Well, hello there. As you can see, I'm dramatically waking up next to my cat in my beautiful room to get on with my beautiful life. I like having plants around the house, as you can see, because it creates a positive energy, vibe, oracle, thing, whatever. You get what I mean. My cat's been stuck like that for a while, and that's okay, he's just stubborn. I like to fold my sheets, and yeah, my cat still doesn't move, anyways. Once I'm awake and convinced that I'm still alive, I notice a pack of Oreos on the floor. And obviously, a morning snack never upset anyone. So I take a... Never mind, it's empty. Anyways, then I just do some stretching, get that yoga going, and feel all pretty like a lifestyle blogger. But then I remember, I'm too broke to pay my electricity. Ooh. Just adjust those confidence pants and march away from your problems. You'll remember this. Then I get onto my laptop because I'm late for class, but that's irrelevant. I have this really cute, so, so, so adorbs 2020 journal. It's a beautiful mint green IRL, but my ring lights has not. So there I am posing with my journal and feel so ready for the day and ready to plan and organize and be productive and shit. I flip through the pages till I get to the, the one page that looks cute and colorful from the one day that I was productive three months ago and I get so so motivated just looking at it. Then I just dramatically grab a pencil and write some tasks for the day into the journal and I never look at it again but I have it in my head so it's all cool. Here are some of the tasks I have on a daily basis. <laughs> I'm still writing into my journal, looking like Rapunzel sitting in her tower all alone with her nasty, greasy ass hair in a bun, writing down my tasks. Anyways, here are some of the tasks that I probably should do in a day. I wasn't trying to be funny, Bethany. Then I just moisturized my lips because I just saw my lip balm there, so why not? Aha! Now the music. Starting off your morning with soothing tunes can really help you keep from wanting to key someone's car or beat up Karen from the sixth floor. So just let it all out, dance it out, get in some arm workout too if you can. Then I like to journal. I'm not kidding. I love journaling. Although I do it like three times a month. I'm trying to look for a decently productive looking page again. So once I'm done with all that jazz, I like to spend some quality thought time with my never mind i'm still showing you the uh very few decently productive looking pages in my journal they're still empty i forgot that i had a journal so i stopped journaling like four months ago but i'm going to probably start doing this journaling again once i'm done with this voiceover anyways flipping through the pages oh god Mario, just cut to the chase man then I like to just spend some quality thought time with myself. Here, for example, I'm thinking about having pancakes for breakfast. I realize I don't have pancakes. Maybe I could just have some cereal and milk. Aha, that's one. Butterflies in my tummy. <laughs> oh my god, that sounded like goofy. Before I go to eat, I do some final planning stuff where I pin up important things onto my pin board, which also I would probably never look at again. So I pin up this dog. Of course, before I head out, I gotta stretch it out. <laughs> wow, why am I still doing that? Anyway, I forgot my camera again, so I'm like coming back. So here I am in the kitchen with my shorts way too high up and my hair greasy as hell, feeling like I haven't eaten in days. Even after the seven meals last night. Something just flew past my camera. Anyways, I'm getting a glass of water because we gotta stay hydrated, of course, and being dramatic about it helps take the edge off in the morning. Just like how some people have a cigarette, you be dramatic about your glass of water. Now I'm dramatically drinking water to soothe all my worries. <laughs> then I remember that I need to wash my face, so I do my life hack. You're welcome. After which, I get lost in thought again and thank the water for clearing my skin. And think about how much, all the things that I have to be thankful for in life. Then I grab a bowl and some cereal. Then I, then I grab a bowl. I grab the bowl and then now I'm gonna grab some cereal. I love, oh my God, I love the cereal. It's the honey cornflakes thing by Kellogg's. I don't, never, oh. I'm- I- I realize I'm out of cereal. Ha! Huh. It's- it's okay. Calm down. Think, Mariam. Think. <laughs> eggs! Eggs. We can do eggs. Let's make some simple- Eggs bolaglaxle, ha! Super simple and barely time-consuming. You will see exactly why. All you gotta do is- This is the easiest recipe you will ever hear of. And forgot my ketchup. Huh. <laughs> Oops. Clumsy, clumsy. Don't forget for little Dory. Then I remember. I should probably brush my teeth. 
I don't need to attract the wrong dogs. So, I'm gonna dramatically take you to the bathroom with me and show you how happy I am to brush my teeth and be awake in the morning and ready for a new day to worry about the same things as yesterday and forgot to pay rent again and maybe pass out early and call it self-care because I'm too lazy to work. <sighs> what am I doing? What am I doing? Anyways, as you can see, my face is nasty as hell, but I'm gonna fix that with some water. And now I'm just brushing my teeth. Then, you know me, I'm going to spend some quality time in my balcony. I'm just thinking about how I have nothing to worry about in life and I'll have to sit here and edit some videos until the flies started coming in. Not even flies, I don't even know what these are. They're just weird insects that scare me. Anyways, I'm just... You know what, forget it. Not everything in life has to go my way. Am I right or am I right? Fucking hell. I'm just gonna leave. Get up, just get up and leave. That's right, that's right. Anyways, then I get all sad and have my morning load off. That's when the disturbing thoughts coming. But I have my motivation here. <laughs> what if I don't get my degree and I have to live alone with 13 bucks in my account and starve some days and I'm just too broke to survive? Never mind. I forgot I was doing just fine like that. Anyways, like and subscribe. Don't cut your bangs. Adios, motherfuckers.